taken off on us for eastbound silver. A wild weekend on the roads. This is just one of several police chases and crashes that took place. And that is our big story tonight at 5. A teenager behind the wheel of a stolen car takes police on a high-speed chase from Glendale to Milwaukee. But that's not the only police chase being investigated today. Fox 6's Angelica Sanchez has a breakdown of overnight chases, including one where the suspect is still on the run. This car's going to be taken off on us. Shortly after high winds swept through southeastern Wisconsin Sunday night, Glendale police spot a stolen Acura just after 8.30. The stolen car is driven recklessly as it tries to get away. Speeds get too dangerous through a construction zone on I-43. For safety reasons, police end the chase near Capitol Drive. It crashed in his front lawn. One subject, gray sweatshirt running westbound. When they check the area, they find the stolen car totaled and the driver on the run. Glendale police tell us it was a 15 year old behind the wheel that stolen car that clearly left its mark on the front lawn of this house in the 8th and Atkinson neighborhood. Glendale police say they arrested the 15 year old boy. He was taken to the Milwaukee County Children's Center. Just a half hour later in Waukesha County, one person was arrested after a police chase in Menominee Falls. This after police began investigating an attempted theft in the town of Lisbon. Police deployed stop sticks and a 23 year old driver was arrested. Charges will include possession of burglary tools and fleeing from police. Back in Milwaukee County, neighbors near 43rd and Loomis and Greenfield woke up to the aftermath of a police chase. DPW crews are working to cut down a tree struck by a suspect car. This police chase began as a case of reckless driving around 2.40 Monday morning. The suspect car lost control and hit this tree before hitting the guardrail on a dead end. You see anyone? Police say the suspect got away. He should be with missing one shoe. How the hell did he survive that? At last check, the suspect is still at large, and it's unknown if the car in this chase was stolen. Reporting in Milwaukee County, Angelica Sanchez, Fox 6 News. Angelica, thank you. Greenfield police say they do not feel there is a danger to the public with the suspect still at large.